Hello America, I just want to through to you today and share a story about my nephew. His, his name's Chase Clinton. He, uh, he's a good young man. He, he found himself caught in the crossfires of today's political realm. And he, uh, he came through for the Democratic Party here. Yeah, he, uh, he helped us prove that we're all slaves to the Republicans and how they use their nanotechnology to to control us over the years and how I was in the Oval Office and if you you know you remember the Monica Lewinsky and everything that took place there in those years he he pointed out how I was under mind control uh, along with the rest of the Democratic Party and it was during these trying times that we knew that we were being set up that we had to rely on a young man who was my nephew and he came through for us in the end. He, it was a something we call a major long play over here on the Democratic side, and you know it was really hard. We're very patriotic uh, countrymen here, and we care about our constituents. And it was, we sometimes we we just really didn't show it as much as we'd have liked because we knew that in the end everything was going to work out for us when we proved that the Republican Party was using their technology to control our minds and make us do illegal things that we wouldn't normally do and it was the technology that even picked us out by our names it was hard to deal with these times we were we knew we were being used and we knew we were just a bunch of slaves to these evil satanic cults over here on the republican side that just used us for uh, everything you could imagine we did all their dirty deeds and we we created globalism because that's what they wanted us to do you see we we weren't for globalism we were patriots but the, they picked us because we were rabbits and it's easy to make a rabbit do what a rabbit's supposed to do whenever you got these wolves over here with their technology their nano mafia technology that just takes over your mind and makes you do things you just normally wouldn't do it just takes you into being out of character sometimes and it was it was these pressing times that we knew if we just went with the flow and listened to my nephew chase that when it was all said and done the evidence would be real clear that the democratic party was slaves to the republican party this entire time and it was military technology and the military industrial complex who lobbies through the republican party that basically used us to do their dirty deeds and they allow the Republicans to get by without having to go through this uh, terrible, terrible trauma-based mind control and things like that. That uh, They allow them to, to get by because they know whenever the military industrial complex comes to the Washington that uh, the Republicans are going to pass the laws that uh, are necessary. And, Sometimes when you have that swing vote that uh, you only need one more vote from a Democrat or something like that to get some sort of military technology implemented, that the, what they'll do is use that mind control and military technology to, to just torture these poor Democrats into doing whatever it is they need to do to vote that way. You see, they used to bribe us, and then this technology came along, and it just made everybody slaves and everything like that. And, you know, it was these pressing times that we had to gruel through because we knew in the long run this young man named Chase would point all of this out for us and make one hell of a case that uh, would uh, absolve us of all the crimes like uh, Joe Biden who's under mind control and even his name was picked by the technology because he has two technologies in him, Biden. You see, that's a home for two technologies. and. There's several names like that in this uh, entire scheme that was put uh, put together where AI's been driving Washington and everything else in that nature. And it was a very troubling, troubling time for us to get through, but uh, we do believe we've come to the conclusion and the case has been put together that the Democratic Party is innocent of anything we've ever done illegally because we have proven it was truly the Republican Party using the military industrial complex's technology to make us do their will and uh, including putting a cigar inside of Monica's vagina 
when I snapped to and realized what had taken place, it just broke my heart what happened. I, I couldn't hardly live with myself during those times. And I just want everybody to know when all of this comes out, America, it's gonna, it's gonna be a heartfelt, uh, even yourselves, America, are being controlled by this technology and you're just not even aware of it. Some of you, some of you may be, some of you might not be, but it is torture for us Democrats to have to go through in order for us to stand up and be, and we're not really standing up because this technology can take over your mind to an extent that you're not even home anymore. So basically we're just walked around like puppets and that's what we are. That's what we've been this whole time. We've, we've been puppet leaders, America, but we knew we, we would have snapped out of it and said something a long time ago, but we had, uh, we had faith in our young man there. Chase, uh, my nephew, Chase Clinton, he came through for us to really solve all these crimes that had actually taken place and uh, absolve us of the crimes that uh, we didn't actually commit by proving how all this technology is used to make us uh, look not only look like clowns, but uh, make us criminals. And yes, America, if you've ever wondered how all of these crimes have been committed and not any of us have ever been persecuted is because they know that we know what had taken place, that it was mind control and nanotechnology. So if they ever took us to the court of law, we would plead insanity and use this uh, information that my nephew here, Chase, has come up with to absolve us of any crimes and we would not even we wouldn't even have to be considered insane after that because he has proven that our minds were under control and it was the the media that was also involved in a lot of this and the, the military industrial complex and DARPA and several several uh, entities of that nature who use technology to wage political warfare and they have basically have taken advantage of the Democratic Party because we just we're free loving people and you know we don't like to uh, commit we don't like to commit hate we're not hateful people we we've been made out to be hateful and it was this technology that made us look that way in the Republican uh, constituents eyes not the actual Republicans who are a bunch of snakes and set us all up with their technology that's how everything went down there America and I just uh, I wanted y'all to hear that from Bill himself, because uh, I'm telling you, this is how this is uh, taking place here in America, and it's a worldwide epidemic now, and it's these uh, these people are really terrible satanic cult that uh, we've got dealing we're dealing with here, and we uh, it took everything we had to have patience and wait for the outcome here to save our people of this country and the world to. Uh, from this tyranny that these people are getting ready to cast down on everybody with their technology. And it is the fourth beast, and God was on our side, America. The Democrat side uh, helped us uh, overcome all of these issues and everything. And I just wanted to share my story with you and uh, shed light on our hero, Chase Clinton, who really came through for us in the end.